Good day. Good morning. Gary and I are going on a solo adventure today. We're going to bring you guys with us. I'm not a morning person, so I'm going to wake up, have a cup of tea, make breakfast for us, shower, and then we'll regroup. <laughs> All right, we're up, we're dressed, kind of. We're showered, we're almost ready to go. We're gonna try and take our hiking backpack that guy can sit in today, because it's just me and her, and I'm not sure how she'll go on my shoulders. The walk we're doing is not crazy long, it's just a day trip, so hopefully we'll be okay. We'll see how we go. I'm gonna pack some lunch, pack our bag. It's fudgy at the door, and then we'll get going. How do you feel, Gaia? Great. Great. I don't know how this is gonna go, because we're taking this pack that we literally never take. Guy loves the idea of sitting in this pack. It's your fire drug thing. Guy loves the idea of sitting in this pack to go for walks, but when she's actually sitting in it, she gets bored very quickly and worried there's gonna be like a lot of up and down. Probably like a normal backpack with something like a trail magic carrier would be a lot better, but I don't wanna have her on my shoulders for the whole time. I don't know how much she'll wanna walk herself. So we're gonna try this and see how it goes. It could be a disaster or it could be amazing, but we're out there doing it and that's the main thing. All right, we're here. Gaia's in the backpack. We're gonna see how this goes. I'm currently bribing her with M&Ms to stay in there, which is not my finest parenting moment. She's super not happy about they're having to leave her fire truck thing in the car and we left Foxy at home. So the morning has not got off to the best start, but we're gonna go for it and see how it goes. I have no idea what to start wearing. When we were on our last hike, I reminded myself of the saying, be bold, start cold, because you heat up so quickly and it's easier to not have to stop and take layers off. But it is quite chilly, although the sun is out, but we're gonna be walking in the bush for the beginning section. So, guys, making a runaway. Where are you going? Okay, should I put you on? Okay, are you ready? Should I, do you think I should leave my jacket on or do you think I should take my jacket off? Leave my jacket on. Leave it on, okay. Do you want to put your feet into these straps? Ready? Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel? Yeah, great. You feel great? How does mama feel? Do I feel great too? Okay. Alright. Um, okay. I'm ready now. Not ready for what? Um, um, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Like that just gone through the kiwi proof gates to protect any kiwis that are living in here and now the infamous shoe washing station <laughs> you can't get them <laughs> they're not lemons they're m ms do you want me to get them out for you? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Have you just tipped them all out? <laughs> oh no, Gaia. <laughs> As you can see, our walk has got off to a great start. Guy just spilt her whole pack of M&Ms all through the carrier, all over me, all over the floor. I've managed to salvage a couple that will not keep us going the whole walk, but the walk to the lookout is actually only half an hour. It will probably take us longer than that, but it's way shorter than what I was expecting for some reason. I think the walk that Josh and I did last time was way longer. I can't remember. How are you going, Gaia? Great, okay. Now that I'm reflecting on it, I remember that last time we did this walk, Josh actually wore jandals for the whole thing, or flip-flops or thongs or whatever you want to call them and so it can't be that strenuous. No lemon. <laughs> They're called M&M's, but not lemons, here you go. m and m I'm also riding solo today, it's just me and Gaia. Hi. 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 I'm Gaia, I hear you. <laughs> I'm also riding solo today, it's just me. Josh is at work, we're having a midweek adventure. 
And so trying to vlog and have everything we need. Wow, one of the triangles. What color is that one? I can't remember name. It's red. Red. Yeah, it's red. That's a red but one. But remember red. You're going to remember that one now. Okay. Red. Trying to vlog and parent and pack everything and carry everything <laughs> on my own Meow. is a new experience. Meow. Oh, I've got a kitten with me. But it's definitely something that I want to start doing more. Meow, meow, meow. This is definitely something I want to start doing more. Going on more adventures with Gaia on my own that are, I don't know, things that we would typically do with Josh. I would like to be able to do by ourselves. Maybe we can work up to doing overnight backpacking trips and stuff because obviously I don't work the same hours that Josh does and I have more flexibility to go and do stuff with Gaia. But we enjoy going with Josh a lot more because we love spending time with him and it's a lot easier with a toddler when there's two parents. But we'll see how today goes. So far so good, I think. started to heat up so we've just stopped to strip off some layers. Gaia is high on sugar from the M&Ms that she keeps calling lemons and we are powering through and I'm trying to remind myself that I want her to enjoy walking and going on bushwalks and these kind of experiences so it's not about rushing her along it's just going at her pace and trying to make it fun and enjoyable and it's not about reaching the end of the walk it's just about being in nature and being outside. So we are currently keeping our eyes peeled for another stream that we might be able to throw some leaves into. <laughs> Thank you. Are you making a video with Mama? Yeah. Yeah, we're making a video of our adventure, aren't we? Sing a song about sheep and cows. Three bags full. And a cow. And a song about cows. What song do we know about cows? Um, on a farm. Oh, Old MacDonald had a farm. Hmm. Old MacDonald had a farm. All right, we have come out into the open, the clearing. So from here, from what I remember, there's like a farmland section to walk through, just like fields. And then you get to the lookout and then we'll be able to turn around and come back. And I think we're doing pretty good. What do you think, Gaia? Yeah, great. Gaia has been fueled by nothing but chocolate so far. She had a dairy-free yogurt pouch in the car and we'll hopefully have our lunch box of snacks either when we get to the lookout or maybe go to the beach afterwards. Maybe go to the beach and dig a big hole. Maybe go to the beach and dig a big hole. Sounds like a plan. With the new spade that Papa bought you. Yeah, we could do that. That's a good idea. Good thinking. What's that? The other foot? The other foot, other foot, all day long in the farm. All day long. All day long. Okay, do you think you can hold on this jumper? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, are you ready to come up? What do you think? I don't have sunglasses. Do you think I need them? One, two, Pookie goes. <laughs> oh, McDonald. There's the lookout. All the cows and the sheep. Oh, these amazing views. Is it really funny, Gaia? Yeah. What are you doing, Gaia? have made it to the top, we made it to the lookout, the signpost was for 30 minutes, it's definitely taken us longer than that. The view up here is amazing, it is the most spectacular day, like, 
Gaia is just having her lunch up the top and we're just admiring this view. It is quite windy. It's a little bit cold for her, so I'm glad we've got the extra layers that we brought, fleecy jumper, etc. But yeah, absolutely beautiful. Should we go a different way? To go back to the car and get your fire truck? Good plan? Good plan. <laughs> we just went to the lookout. There was a guy up there, he's a volunteer. He's telling people about a planting day that's happening this Sunday to plant more trees, which is really exciting. Amazing conservation efforts going on from volunteers. He was a bit rude about people taking photos. He said, it's a shame people come up here and take photos, they should just be in the experience or whatever, which I agree with. We sat and looked at the view, had our lunch up there, weren't on our phone or filming anything for a lot of it. But also people experience things in different ways. I don't know, personally I think if people want to go somewhere and take photos and videos for their memories or to show their friends or for whatever reason, that should be totally fine. Doesn't affect anyone else. But anyway, it's quite windy. Hopefully you can hear this all right. This walk is amazing because we're just walking along with sheep, and cows made a bold decision and as we were going to go back down through the bush track that I am familiar with I saw the sign said that track was 25 minutes and this alternative track is 35 minutes so we're going for it aren't we Gaia yeah we're gonna go this different route back to the car and see how it goes it is absolutely beautiful poo. yeah there is some poo isn't there what a perfect day it's more poo, I know because that's because there's all the sheeps and the cows up here. Just absolutely incredible day for it and I'm so glad that me and Gaia have got out to do this. And she's doing a really great job being in the backpack, which is surprising because I didn't think she would stay in for that long. So it means we can cover a bit more ground. You are like the sinky pooey. You are like the sinky pooey. What, the sheep or the cows? Okay. Whoa, a bit muddy. This track I think will take us more along like the main roads and stuff and Gaia has asked to go to the beach afterwards. There is a really beautiful beach here in Shakespeare Regional Park so we might go there afterwards. Did I even say where we were Gaia? We are in Shakespeare Regional Park and it's like under an hour drive from central Auckland. I think it's probably about 45 minutes or something to get out here. So the camera just ran out of battery and now I'm using my phone and the quality is probably not going to be as good. So I'm going to call it a wrap. Gaia has done amazing. I think she's going to get out and walk a little bit yourself now, eh Gaia? And then we're going to go to the beach, enjoy the rest of our day. It's only like midday or something. So yeah, it's been really beautiful. Oh look, a little bird. It's a little fantail. If you're looking for a super cool adventure not far from Auckland, highly, highly recommend coming here. There's so many walking tracks to choose from. And yeah, we're gonna go look for a little fantail. So the walk that we've done to come out has brought us back onto the same loop trap. Same, so the walk we've done to come so the walk we've done so the walk we've done on the way out has brought us back onto the same bush track we were on before which is super cool it joins up around where the waterfall was so it's not too far cool baba and it's meant that we got to enjoy more of the scenery of like the epic landscape and overlooking the peninsula which was really cool because when you're in the bush that's super special as well but in a different way so i'm really glad we went that way we're back on the bush track now you can do it i'm watching i believe you can do it gaia has definitely mentioned several times that she misses her dad which is often the case when he's at work anyway so hopefully we can build up to doing more midweek adventures like this and little smaller days out but we'll see how we go it's been absolutely beautiful though we've had such a good time and i'm so grateful to be out in nature mm -hmm.